Hello friend, welcome back to the channel. Hope everybody is doing well. I am also doing fantastic because all of your love, support and the subscription are really overwhelmed. And thank you again. So come to the point. Today I will be sharing another cooking video which will be not a time consuming and very easy to make. The kids will love it. The entire family will love it because I know I liking it personally. So the name of the recipe is restaurant style vegetable lo mein. I know all of you know how to cook the vegetable lo mein, but I will share today my own trick. So stay tuned with me. Don't go anywhere and have take a look what the ingredients I'm using for. Here is all the ingredients I'm using for. Now I will show you one by one all the ingredients. Here is some sunflower oil. This is optional. You can use olive oil too. This is black pepper. This is salt. Very less amount of salt I will be using because I will use the soy sauce. Soy sauce already has some salt in it. And here is the lo mein. I am using for two people that much lo mein I already have boiled. And here is all the vegetables I will be using for. Finely chopped carrot, cabbage, broccoli, red bell pepper and green pepper. Means capsicum. Here I will be using asafoetida. Means the hen. And here all the ingredients. Take a look one more time. Let's go straight for the cooking. This is the time. I already have owned my oven. And here you can see. Here is the two bowl I already put in my oven. The first pot you saw I already have dropped some oil around two tablespoon of sunflower oil and now the time to put the spice the firstly I will be using some black pepper on the oil the oil the oil is already preheated now some asapoetida mix them well nicely so that all the aroma goes into the oil Now I will be adding all the vegetable. Now you can see how I cut it all the vegetable. They are all in one shape like long. I cut them as a long. They are all in one shape. So that they mix like the same thing like they can look like a same. If I chop them broccoli in one size, carrot in one size, it's not look so good. That's why I cut it that. Now the time to my lid off. And this bowl I will be using to make my sauce. Because all of you know, lo mein needs sauce. So here I'm adding like maybe one teaspoon of oil the same ingredients the black pepper little bit of asapoetida now the time to add the ingredients soy sauce around four to five tablespoon and of course you have to add some water also so that they cook nicely yes little bit of salt you have to add here at the same time you will be cooking the vegetable also and the sauce I didn't add the salt before so that's why I'm adding the salt now but very less amount because soy sauce has salt 
Now the thyme, the sauce and the vegetable. Yes, it's mixed together. So for the vegetable cooking, you need only two minutes so that all the color stay remain same. We don't need to destroy the color. Now you can add your lo mein here. Mix them well nicely so that all the vegetable and lo mein mix very nicely. Look how I mix them. And this is the time I adding some chopped raw cabbage. That will make a different aroma. This is the special trick I am using here. And you can see already. So I didn't use too much spices here. Only the black pepper and the salt, soy sauce and oil. That's I use it. It's time to serve on the plate. You can see all the color of the vegetable is the same as when I cut it. it. So we need to when we will cook the lo mein, we need to think about the color of the vegetable. We need to make it more colorful so that people get attracted and easily they can enjoy the food now the time to garnishing you can garnish with tomato you can garnish with cucumber that's how i am garnishing it at last you can put one slice of lemon And I didn't put the green chili inside the cooking. So for garnishing, you can obviously add green chili. That is optional. If you don't like it, you can skip it. And just for garnishing, I'm using one mint leaf. That also optional. So that it looks more colorful. That's why I'm adding it. That's how the entire look. After cooking my lo mein, I hope you guys enjoy it. Let's show you more closer. Look how colorful it is. Now I will be showing you from very close so that you can understand how it exactly came. So this is the entire cooking it was today. So hope everybody enjoy it. And please let me know in the comment section how you enjoy the cooking. And try at your home. Feed your family, guest. And please subscribe the channel if you like it. And don't forget to like, comment and share. Till then tata. Bye bye. Love you and take care. We will be meet with another video very soon. Thank you for watching. Bye.